I'm going to show you how easy it was to make this rain barrel with the earth-minded do-it-yourself rain barrel parts kit. You will see how to prepare the location, install fittings on the barrel, connect the barrel to the downspout, and learn about winterizing and filtration. This kit will work with many kinds of barrels or containers. Plastic 55-gallon tight head drums are the easiest to find. Online classified ads like Craigslist are a good place to look for one. If you're going to use an open top barrel or a container with a removable lid, please refer to the instructions that come with your kit. There are some slight differences. This do-it-yourself rain barrel kit comes with all the fittings you need. It even includes three hole saws. You will need a few basic tools and safety equipment. The barrel has to be installed on a firm level surface so it won't sink in or tip over. It has to be close enough to the downspout so the fill hose will reach. You will need the appropriate tools to dig, some pea gravel, pavers, a measuring tape, a level, and something to mark the corners of your hole. Weed cloth is optional. Measure over from your downspout, less than 3 feet. Measure and mark the ground. 28 by 28 inches works well for this setup. Remove 2 to 3 inches of soil. Put down the weed cloth. Dump enough pea gravel into the fill hole. Spread the gravel evenly and pack it down. Check to make sure the gravel base is level. Place your pavers and make sure they're level. Add some more gravel to keep your pavers from shifting. Set up your barrel and make sure it's level. You can place the front drain fittings in the locations that work best for you. For instance, you might want two fittings at the bottom of your barrel for draining, or one slightly higher than the other so that you can get your watering can underneath of it. The water inlet fitting can be installed at any location around the top of the barrel. The only limitation is the maximum length of the fill hose. The kit includes two front drain fittings. You need one almost at the bottom so you can drain as much of your rainwater as possible. You can choose your own location for the second fitting. Measure up two and a half inches from the bottom of the barrel. Make sure you're away from any seams and you're up past the curved part. Drill a hole in the barrel using the smallest hole saw. Place a watering can next to the barrel and mark the location for the second front drain fitting. Drill another hole in the barrel, still using the smallest hole saw. Insert the threaded rubber seals into the holes. It helps to pinch them and use some soapy water so that they go in more easily. Screw in the spigot and drain connector until the hex collars are snug against the seals. You can place the water inlet fitting in the location that works best for you. Measure down 3 inches from the top of the barrel. Drill a hole in the barrel using the medium hole saw. Insert one of the rubber seals into the hole. With your barrel in place, set a level on top, move it over to reach the downspout, check the bubble, and make a mark on the downspout level with the top of the barrel. Make another line in the middle of the downspout. The FlexiFit diverter works with two sizes of downspouts, 2 by 3 inches and 3 by 4 inches. Be sure you mark and drill only on the 3 inch side. Use the largest hole saw to cut into the downspout. Make sure the arrow points up as you squeeze the diverter sides and push it straight into the hole in the downspout. Use two of the self-tapping screws to hold the diverter in place. Connect the fill hose to the diverter. If you need to shorten the fill hose, cut it at one of the flat sections. Connect the other end of the fill hose to the water inlet fitting on the barrel. You can use a piece of fishing line to make sure that you don't lose your winter hole cover. Now you're ready to harvest the rain. Be sure that you close your front drain fittings so your rainwater doesn't run out. Don't let water freeze in your rain barrel. You need to disconnect your barrel and drain it completely. Attach the winter hole cover with two screws. If your downspouts collect a lot of debris, you should consider a downspout filter.
So now you're ready to make your own rain barrel with the Earth-Minded Do-It-Yourself Rain Barrel Kit. To purchase the Earth-Minded Do-It-Yourself Rain Barrel Kit, go to rainbarrelparts.com.